Good morning, everybody. Today, this is a I was using this tripod yesterday for the doorbell thing. But today, <clears throat> what do we have here? Hmm. Ah. Oh, uh, my good friend Generic on Twitter. Very nice. Um, today is life hack day. I'm going to be fixing my life. There's a lot of things that have really been bothering me and they pile up and I'm great. I mean, one of my specialties, one of my God-given gifts is the ability to just forget it and just put it back. Put it at the back of my mind. Oh, this needs to be done. Bleh. Hey, this needs to be done. Bleh. Forget it. Forget it. Don't worry about it. But today, that changes. For example, this cabinet, for the longest time, has not been closing all the way. I mean, weeks, weeks and weeks and weeks, this cabinet would not close. You know why it won't close? Napkins right here. And it's been driving me crazy. I go up to it and I just push, push, push. You know how I solve this? Just simply take the napkins out, open them up like so. And let's just, let's not open them up crazy, but let's just open them like that. Take out a stack, put them where the napkins go, over here, which we're out of napkins anyway, and then put it back in like this, like this, and closes all the way. Life hack day is gonna be fantastic. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> I probably got more sleep these past two nights than I have in months, and I'm so, so tired. Okay, you ring the bell. Your bell. Is that doorbell? Is it going? Yeah. It's cold right there, isn't it? Door, door, door. Door, door, door. Catch. Catch. Oh, you got the knife in right. Good job. Oh, first do I Again. 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 Do you want mom to make one for you? There's kind of shirt. Hey, princess. Come here. Come here. No, no, no. I did it right. <laughs> <laughs> Are you doing a video? No. Oh, she no, said no. there's like a big clump or something. Where's Ari? Here. Yeah, it's gonna fall. <gasps> Hi, where's Bay? Oh, there she is. So, Aunt Tori is getting ready to leave. Did you give her a hug? Yes, I did. I gave her a big hug. We're gonna see if Ariel give her a hug. Ariel's very busy Bye. with her tent. She calls her cousin Brady Bay. Isn't that adorable? You can give her a hug. Ariel, give her a hug. <laughs> okay, I just did a bunch of work. Ate two pieces of chicken, and uh, I, I've been thinking about some things that have been bothering me around the house, some more things, and I have one. So, so this is a little sectional we bought at our old house and uh, for the outside, and it's nice, it's kind of nice, but there is a little bit of a problem with it. Let me put the cushions on and show you. Whenever I sit here in this spot, uh, I like to sit back and recline like this. And when I recline like this, what ends up happening is the cushion slides all the way to here. And eventually, if I'm here long enough, I'm down. I'm down flat like this. It's so stupid. So I have to hack these things to where they don't fall anymore. I need rubber. I need something rubber somewhere. Just like little rubber pieces, little rubber, like bottom of the chair rubber things. Possibly. Aha! These. These could potentially work. Uh, let me try these. Alright, let's give this a shot. These are sticky. They stick down. Now this is probably not good. Like, it's not weather resistant. So it's not like a permanent solution. I could maybe try to super glue these down. But if I put these down here, 
Oh, that one's sticking. And this one, like here. This is just a test to see if this will work. Okay, here I am, sitting in the chair. I'm reclined back. I'm not sliding. I'm not sliding at all. Yeah, I can't, I can't get it to move. I life hacked. So I am heading to John's parents right now because my sister is heading back to the airport and when Ari woke up from her nap, the first thing she said when I picked her up was, Snickers? So I think she wants to see the dog one more time and I'm sure Gigi and Grandpa want to see her. So that's where we're headed right now. I don't blame you. <laughs> Bubbles! Yay! Cool! Oh! Snickers! Snickers! <laughs> so I just actually watched the vlog from yesterday and I gotta say, John, you look really nice in normal clothes. I think that's the first time I've seen you in a normal shirt and not a t-shirt in a really long time, especially just like around the house. You probably should start wearing clothes, normal clothes more often. Also, I think I have needle nose pliers in my toolbox. John doesn't like to get in my toolbox because it, he says it has a weird smell and it does. I don't know why, but it has a very weird smell, but I'm pretty sure I have needle nose pliers in there. So that could have made your job a little easier. Hey, do you miss Dad? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, we're going to go see him tomorrow. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I don't know what you're saying. I didn't know I was so great at life hacking. I'm going to life hack some more things. Check this out. So, through this door is, this is our garage right out there. That's the garage. And if you follow me this way, going up the stairs, uh, just right around here, just right around that corner right there is where the garage door is. We go up here and you see Eden's bedroom. Well, there, that's Aries, that's Eden's. So the garage is right below us here. And if Eden's taking a nap or something, have a listen to this. It's extremely loud. So, and my garage door, it's not as loud, but it's, it's pretty loud. Time to life hack it. Hey, Ed, how you doing? Oh, yeah, yep, she's, she just hit the two month mark. So she's, okay, sounds good, we'll talk to you Monday. Bye. Life hacked. Got a garage door company coming out to fix the garage doors. Life hacked. I've got it. I've got just the thing. Okay, here's something. Uh, every morning we get coffee and we do it in this Keurig because it's the easiest. It's the most convenient. Boy, I'm red right now. It's the most convenient. But we've got this banned coffee that we love. Banned, not bad. And then we've got this murdered out uh, black rifle coffee that we want us to try but here's the frustrating thing we can try those in the Keurig but they got to be in this thing this little thing and let me show you how it works now I don't really have a solution for this this is just something I need to life hack uh, so is this thing is this on yes it's on so this twists off and th this thing goes in the Keurig right this twists off and then you take out this little cartridge thing right there's this little cartridge here, but the coffee all gets kind of stuck in there. It's like, it's really hard to get out. And then you can look, get my face out of the way. You can kind of see, like it's all stuck in there. And to get it out, it's really annoying. You hit it on the side, but then you gotta like rinse it out. And then you're rinsing it, but it's a filter. So it doesn't like drain out. You gotta like blast it and turn it over. I wonder if there's like a tool. I've got it, a knife. If I just have a knife over here, even if there's a dirty one in the sink or whatever, I just take a knife, put it in there, boom, they come out, 
E oh, simple. Okay, life is easy again. Life hack. I ha I hacked it. Back in the garage. Here in my garage. I can't do it anymore because I got blue hair, but I did a really good impression of that one day. Every time I get in my truck and I turn it on, this happens. Watch right there. Watch. Watch. Check right front tire pressure. And then I have to push this button. It'll beep. Okay, I need to change my oil. Yes. That could be a life hack that I could do. Check right front tire pressure. I'm pressing this button over here. It says front right tire is 23. Now, it's off, it's wrong. It's actually my back left tire that's 23. Way low. Time to hack it. Let's get hacking. Let's get hacking. Yes, get freaking hacked. Turn the car on. And you'll see only change engine oil is on. <laughs> Check that out, man. And let's check the tire pressure. Oh, yeah, baby. It just my. What's wrong with the fr front tires? Oh, boy. There's not a day that goes by where I don't start it out by saying, I'm going to work out today. Today, I'm going to work out. I'm going to get on the weight machine and I'm going to do a nice workout. Well, I've got the perfect hack to make sure that I work out every day. You just walk right by it, you never see it. You just go right into your office and go to work. Oh, that TV's about to get life hacked. But you just come in here. But, if I come downstairs and see this, wait, 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 hold on, for effect. If I come downstairs and it's super dark and I never notice it, but I see this, oh yeah. Now I'm gonna work out tomorrow. Life hacked. I just did a workout. I, I, I worked for a little bit. I got my video done for today and uploaded. And I got tomorrow's video done. And I'm gonna start working on the vlog. But then I came out, cause I was hungry. I'm coming up to eat. And I did a workout, cause I saw the light was on. Life hacked, I did it. Here, there is one problem. Um, it's like eight o'clock and today I've eaten oatmeal, and two pieces of chicken. Not great. Uh, and we are out of food. Like there's no meat anywhere. And there's no way to make us, there's nothing. Peanut butter and jelly, there's nothing. Are there eggs? There are eggs, but just eggs, it doesn't last. Life hacked. Pizza. I went and got pizza. I'll be able to have uh, just a couple pieces now, and then tomorrow when I get hungry and we don't, I don't have food, I can have the other pieces then. And we were out of Diet Pepsi, so I went to the corner store. Life hack. I went to the party store that has refrigerated sodas, like a 12, 16 pack. Life hacked. The whole thing. Life hacked.